Good morning, my lovelies. Guess where I'm going? I am going to an actual hair salon. So, my poor hairdresser, you know, I, I've been having my hair done at home for years. She is really not well. She hasn't been well for a while and we had to cancel my appointment twice now. Um, so I've decided to go to the salon and it's a salon that she used to work at and I used to work there probably 13 years ago uh, so I still know I think three girls that work there but the rest I don't know and I've booked it online so I booked it with someone that I don't know so I'm really nervous you know what it's like when you've had your hair done by someone for such a long time and they know exactly what you like but needs a must and so my dream hair color i show you is that i've got here a few pictures to show her something like this but things like this are really hard to achieve when you do hairdressing at home, you know, you because you need to tone it and for that you need a basin really. And you know, at home you just wash your hair over the bath, so it's a bit awkward. So we will see what she can do for me, but I am really nervous and but on the other hand, it'd be nice, you know, to be pampered, to have someone to wash your hair. I make you a cup of coffee not like at home you know so we will see but honestly I'm so nervous it's ridiculous I'm nervous to having my hair done um, but it'd be fun to see all the girls there so yeah I'll show you afterwards what I look like okay my hair is done I've had uh, no dark put in today, just loads and loads of baby lights. Um, you can still see my old dark ones, but I'm trying to grow that out because I'm thinking of having what I've shown you before on my phone. Uh, it's just like being blonde and have like shadow root underneath. So. I have to grow out all these low lights that I have around which might take a year so I don't know yet but it's really really lovely and blonde I didn't have a proper blow dry I told them not to bother because I'm going to the gym tomorrow I'm gonna be sweaty it's a waste of a blow dry I was there four hours honestly it takes almost two hours just to put all the foils in that's how many foils i have in so i feel like i've been here all day okay my lovelies i'll see you later good morning my lovelies i've just dropped louis off uh, at the groomer what i didn't tell you i don't think i told you uh, we are going to spain tomorrow so that's why there was how didn't I tell you? That's why there was such a panic with my hair that I couldn't have my hair done because I obviously wanted to have it done before we went to Spain. Um, but my hairdresser is not well. She's still not well. Um, so, yes, hair done. I faked on myself yesterday. I feel so much better. I probably can't see in this camera because, you know, this camera makes me look like a ghost. But I did look like a ghost. I always fake tan, even in a winter. I just, in a winter, I just use that spray, just like my face and chest and my hands, just the bits that you see. <laughs> because I absolutely hate being uh, pale. I am so so white, and you know this. Um, it's not melasma. It's that POC that I have on my neck. It looks even worse when um, when I'm really pale because the middle of my neck is white like see-through and everywhere else I'm white and I just have this dark like collar you know on my neck um, and obviously in Spain it's still warm so I will be wearing summer clothes so I um, I had to fake tan I didn't fake tan for like a 
month or two months and I was getting just whiter and whiter so yes everything's done I'm gonna go home now and start packing so we uh, chose to uh, fly from Bormos because our friends that look after Louis live in Bormos and the airport is like 15 minutes away from them so it's very very convenient so we're gonna drop off Louis I hate it so much although he loves them and I know he's happy there but he's still upset when uh, we leave him uh, and then when we we only go in for a week when we come back we're coming back quite late in the evening we are going to stay overnight with our friends and then go home the next day so yes I'm gonna see my mom and we're going to have a lovely time so we are going to celebrate my birthday there you know those vlogs are always like week behind so when you're seeing this video I will be back I'll be just back um, it was my mum's birthday on the 19th of October so we sort of will celebrate our birthdays together right my lovelies probably next time I see you will be in Spain hello my lovelies we've just arrived in Spain there is my mum and Paul look at her she looks about 12 <laughs> 28 one bloke told me oh, 28 right we've just arrived so we're going to have something to eat now <laughs> here's the spread my mum has prepared sort of charcuterie spread <laughs> good morning from sunny Spain we are just going for a walk we're gonna walk to Malaga Center it's Sunday today so I think most things are closed but we are taking advantage of this gorgeous sunny weather my lovelies it's my birthday today and we are just about to go to a restaurant for a meal mum is wearing a Beltres Devotion in Butterbeer Blonde you always say you want to see the wigs on my mum so <laughs> so that's the Devotion so yes we are going to go and have a lovely meal good morning my lovelies it's the day after my birthday I'm still in bed well, I've been up, had a cup of tea, but it's nice not to have to get up for anything. <laughs> we were going to get in a car today. We, we've hired a car so we can take my mum places because she doesn't drive. And we were going to go to Puerto Banos and then Sabania. It's a place where my mum used to live, right on a beachfront. We'll go and have a shower, get ready, and then we will decide if we are going to go today or maybe tomorrow. Sorry about the noise, but there is a building work going on next door. My lips still look really red. I wore one of the Lisa Eldridge's lipsticks um, last night. I think it was the Skyscraper Rose. And I think it stained my lips. I removed my makeup properly, but I think it stained my lips a bit. Yes, so um, yesterday we went to Malaga, you saw that. And um, I bought some jewelry, you know, like inexpensive jewelry, stainless steel. There is, I don't know, it's probably not even gold plated, but gold color. Uh, I bought a really nice dress. 
and that's it I think um, but I might show you all that I've bought in the next video you know when I come back home my mum is still in bed so we had quite a late night last night celebrating my birthday but like I said we are not in a rush for anything it's just nice chilling out nice break <music> have just arrived at Sabanias. This is where my mum used to live about 10 years ago and she used to live right on a beach really. So we've just brought her here in memory lane, see what's changed um, and I will show you later where she used to live. Today, um, Mum is wearing Henry Margot. Is it Kendall? Um, Kendall. Kendall. I can't remember what colour it is, but it's Henry Margot Kendall. But she cut the fringe. You cut the fringe, didn't you? It looks really lovely. I think this one is really, really natural looking. Yeah. He doesn't have it's too, not much too much hair. hair. Yeah. I think it's just so natural. Yeah. Yeah, that one looks really nice. Mm, I like my favorite. It's your favorite. And what about that grey one? Remember from no, the, with that all my favorite ones. All, all your favorites. <laughs> so this is where my mum used to live in that building before she moved to Malaga. It's really lovely day. They had swimming pool as well. I can't really see it from here, yeah, but it was lovely because it was so right on a beach. <laughs> you cannot see anything, look. No, Oh, look at the clouds, how beautiful the clouds are. Yeah, it was lovely when Max was little to come. 
come here because the beach was just there but in the winter here it's a bit boring so it would be very lonely for my mum right now so she's better off in Malaga we are going to go to Duquesa port now for Chinese from sunny Spain uh, we are going just the two of us today uh, we are going to Mijas we've been there haven't we a long time ago but I can't remember it up now. in the mountains yeah up in the mountains it's a beautiful sunny day yesterday was raining a bit which we were not happy about <laughs> but yeah today there is no cloud in the sky so we are taking advantage of this nice weather from the top of me house what an incredible view on our way to Malaga port for dinner it's a lovely warm evening mum is taking us by a shortcut but it doesn't look like a shortcut it is. <laughs> seems very long <laughs> yes this shortcut doesn't seem like a shortcut at all
morning my lovelies so we are back I've only just unpacked sorted all the washing so I'm doing the washing and now I'm just getting ready quickly very very busy day we our plane was late like about an hour and a half and it was already late flight anyway so we've decided um i texted my friend i said we will just pick up louis and we will go i feel so bad you know putting them out that they had to wait up for us anyway and if you were staying you know once you got off the plane you were wide awake i then i would have had to drag my suitcase in to get my PJs out and and stuff to take my makeup off and all this and then they would have to get up in the morning you know what it's like having guests making breakfast and I really didn't want to put that on them so we said we will just drive home it's middle of the night no traffic so that's what we did we got home at two in the morning so and I was up at eight so I'm doing all that and I have to put this video together for you so I can post it tomorrow. I don't know what this video is going to look like because, you know, we were doing so many different things. And one day I would do something with my camera, the next with my phone. So I don't know what footage I have. But now back to reality. I am so busy this week um, with YouTube. I have... Um, I don't even know if you will have a video for Wednesday, this Wednesday, probably not, so sorry about that, but yeah, back to reality, um, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, <laughs> uh, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next week, bye, oh, and stay fabulous, you see, I even forgot that, <laughs> bye.